Hey guys, welcome back to RoboStout. My name is Darren, and on today's show, I got Apple AirTags. That's right, I just got these in. Been playing with them during the week here, and I figured I would share what I've had my own experience. It's been pretty cool. Obviously, there's been tons of different types of tagging systems out there that are Bluetooth and Wi-Fi, so Apple's jumped into the game and brought out theirs. And we're gonna see just how well these little guys work uh, trying to find them through the house right after this. Alrighty, here it is, the AirTags. I got the four pack version here. Uh, this was, what, 99 bucks, uh, got it on in. And uh, let's open it up, take a look. Yep, there's all four of them right there. Pretty simple to use. Instructions kind of show you what to do on here. So let's go ahead and let's get my phone and uh, let's play around with it and get them set up for the first time. Alrighty, so I've got my phone here. Let's go ahead and start with this. First and foremost, if you follow the instructions, you want to make sure that you update it to the latest iOS uh, or I, iPad OS. Make sure that you are all updated so you're ready to go on this piece here. Very simple to do. Following the instructions, I'm going to take one out here. You'll notice this has a little plastic ribbon around it. You're gonna go ahead and pull that off. That's automatically gonna activate as soon as I pop that out. It has now activated the, the battery on here. I'm gonna put this close by, and there we go. Here, let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit more. See how it's connected right there? We're gonna go ahead and follow the prompts with this. And uh, this one will be keys. We'll put these on a pair of keys. Verify my information. There you go. Now I have it connected to my phone itself. Uh, this has precision finding on there. So when AirTag is nearby, it'll show an arrow on what you're going to be utilizing on there. I can play sound. I can get directions and maps. Uh, I can find everything I need to, and I can find this right into my app. So if you notice, I'm in here now. I've got my key. It actually has a little symbol on there as a key. And I can play sound. So closer up, you can see, if you look at the phone, as I move this around and I get away from it, it starts to track it. And as I get closer, you can see on there, it shows right in there. Now the phone itself will actually start to vibrate uh, in your hand when you're getting closer to the target itself, which is great. And remember, this uses a little bit of an iPhone network system too. So even if you're outside or whatnot, if this is close to another iPhone that has it uh, well, basically, you gotta make sure your settings on that other iPhone is there too, but it will also help try to find it out there. But it's pretty sensitive. I, I've had a tile before, and those always took a second to catch up, but this one here, it's pretty strong. Interesting to see how long, you know, battery la lasts on here, how much time it uh, allows you on it, so that's more of just uh, uh, usage time that we're working on, so. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and let's put it in some real life and see how it works uh, trying to find the keys. I'll have the kids hide it around the house and uh, we'll do a screenshot of my phone and uh, see if we can find them. Do me a favor, go hide that somewhere in the house. Okay, so I've got a phone over a phone and we're gonna go ahead and try to find where Evan hid this in the house here. So let's go to find my phone. Found my phone area, I've got the keys already set up there. And so um, I'm now going to try to find these. So I'm gonna click on them here and I'm gonna go hit find. And let's uh, let's search around the house here. So I'm in 15 feet, I don't know where he went. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go this direction. But I have a feeling I think he went upstairs because there's not there. I'm nearby it. Yeah, see? definitely upstairs because then anybody directs me to go I lose it so looks like we're heading upstairs going into this room I can feel it I feel it vibrating I'm close I'm very close I can't see anything Let me turn my flashlight on because it allows me to do flashlight. I feel it. And uh, there it is. Mm -hmm. 
you hit it pretty good. That was pretty hard to find. That actually worked out pretty well, so awesome. And found it here. All right, final thoughts on this. It was actually kind of fun. I mean, we we hid this, or I should say, he hid this pretty well right in the closet area that, um, behind a whole bunch of stuff. And I was able to track it down. He did not tell me where it's at, um, but uh, it worked pretty well. I've actually used this outside, uh, put it in the car, trying to find where the car is at. Um, it has a little bit of difficult if it doesn't have a good enough signal around it. Um, but for things as simple as where did I put my keys, uh, maybe put it on a backpack, things like that, uh, be able to connect to it, uh, it does a great job. It's very similar to all the other products that are out there, but this one being associated with Apple and obviously the whole atmosphere with it, um, it makes it a little bit easier to try to find these pieces. If you like this video, definitely check out some of my other videos that are gonna be popping up somewhere on your screen. Subscribe because I'd love to have you come back and see me and uh, you know in the comments tell me if you grab some of these and thoughts uh, what your thought process on it love to hear it until then I will see you guys on the flip side peace